Voluntary society, a voluntary society, voluntary community, or voluntary city, or voluntary orbiculous place is one in which all property, including streets, parks, etc., and all services, including courts, police, etc., are provided through voluntary means, such as private or corporative ownership. In a voluntary society, the notion of something being privately or corporatively owned would be radically different from monopolistic privatization with state subsidies or monopolistic control of public resources by the state, respectively. Instead, courts might be replaced with dispute resolution organizations, police with volunteer-based community defense organizations or private security agencies and crime insurers, transportation authorities with community road associations and rail counterparts, etc. These services were the subject of the book The Voluntary City, which dealt with them chapter by chapter. Anarcho-capitalists as well as anti-capitalist market anarchists view voluntary society as the solution to the conflict between those who favor government allowing behaviors and arrangements such as non-violent drug use, free stores, sexual liberation, voluntary communal sharing, exempla grata, food not bombs, etc., and those who favor government restrictions on such activities. Those who want to live under a certain code of conduct can move to a community that supports and protects it. Prominent anarcho-capitalists such as Stefan Molnir suggest that in a voluntary society, dispute resolution organizations and pollution insurance companies would prevent problems such as pollution.